after a stunning revelation at the Senate that face masks obtained by the government from Farmley could have had their expiration dates changed, the House again comes to the defense of the Duterte administration. During the continuation of the House Good Government and Public Accountability Panel's probe, Tiwa Representative Michael Aglipay asks, May nagkasakit po ba at saka may namatay? Wala naman po sa pagkakaalam namin po. Surigao 2nd District Representative Johnny Pimentel also concludes the government had no losses in the deal if the face shields had been used. The issue is not the expiry, but rather kung nagamit ba ng ating mga frontliners. We have already established that the face shields were distributed, were utilized, so meaning Wala luge. Meantime, President Rodrigo Duterte's office will leave it up to the Justice Department to decide on whether or not it should begin an investigation on Farmily. Presidential spokesman Harry Roque also says the testimonies at the Senate are not yet strong. Farmily Executive Grizel Grace Mago admitted on Friday, September 24, that Farmily is swindling the government. Two days after her admission, Mago can no longer be contacted by the Senate Blue Ribbon Committee. Senator Richard Gordon confirms this on Twitter Sunday, September 26.